this defense build goes so crazy. In my opinion, at least, it's the best one so far, and it does utilize the the last two DLCs, the Edo Minato and the Ishiki Ososuki. Look, yo, this build's gonna go crazy. Let's get right to it. Now for the weapon, the Giant Scythe. It, it don't matter the color; it's the same thing. But the Giant Scythe, in my opinion, has the best combos for the defensive builds. It goes so tough. It's just like the best weapon. I ain't gonna lie. Now chakra rods for the ninja tool. They won't see it coming. That's really what it's for. And also, it does take away their their subs. And I ain't gonna lie, these well, chakra rods are so tough. It, it it is called black staff as you see, but it's chakra rods. But I don't know why they call them a black staff. It's literally a chakra rod. Now for the ninjutsu one, I'm gonna go with the air slice type zero. This is from the Edo Minato. I ain't gonna lie, that that countdown timer, only 18 seconds, that's a great. And this move could hit, it could really hit up to anybody who's in range. Like, I ain't gonna lie, if, you, if you're playing in that little survival mode, if you see two people fighting, throw it at them, you're gonna get both of them and go crazy. I ain't gonna lie. Now, for the Ninjutsu 2, I'm going with Karma. Let me tell you why. Karma, it is a two-hit attack. So, if you... If you do catch him in the in the in the initial choke in the initial karma, it basically hits him with a karma mark, and then after that you can obviously press R1 and it'll like blitz you to a kick on him and it'll go so crazy. I ain't gonna lie. Now for the substitution, I'm gonna go with the emergency exit, and that's because it does heal you after you sub out. So it's basically perfect. I ain't gonna lie. Other alternative could obviously be, in my opinion, of course, that I always love to use. The uh, crystal ice mirrors, that one goes so tough in my opinion. And now for the ultimate art, I'm going to go with the heavens. I don't even know what it's called, but I'm going to go with Ishiki's ultimate. In my opinion, that's the best one. All the ones that you could use, I personally like Neji's, the 128 palms. They both go so tough. They, they both go crazy. I ain't going to lie. But yeah, look. This build right here, like I said, it goes crazy. And obviously, 5 likes for the gameplay. And I'm going to drop it. It's going to be so tough. I'm telling you, I'm going to drop these kids off. Like, that's really all I can say. I'm going to drop these kids off. Now, yeah, you know, just don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you're new. I'm gone.